Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to let the doors open for any of the buildings that generated by using the building gen plugin in iClone 8 3D animation software. Now let's have a look. This is a building that I generated or I apply by using the building gens or just any of the building that's led by using the building gen sampler. Now you can see my door all can open properly. But actually, the original door cannot be opened like, like this. Now you can see all of this door. I can open it. And everything looks normal. However, we are going to have a look. If I just drag in any of the building joint buildings, actually the door cannot open properly like that. So how to make it be able to open you can see this is the original version. If I press Q and I double click the door, then I press E. Actually, the door cannot open properly. So to make sure the door can open properly, what you need to do is just press Q and double click the door and press E. Double click the door and press E so that you can see the gizmo. Then you have to go to here under the attribute, then scroll down until you see the pivot. Once you already see the pivot, again double click it, press E. Once you already can see the pivot, just click any of the corner, then press, press E, you can open. So Ctrl Z is to undo. So if you click another side, let's say right hand side, then the pivot point will change it to right hand side. You press E, then you can open. This is this is the way on how to make sure all of the doors in building generator can be opened properly, like mine. Right, that's all for today about my tutorials on how to let any of the doors that can open properly for any of the building joints plugins. If you not yet get the get the building gems, you can just go to freedom3d.net, my website to get it, or you can just scroll down, go to my video description. I already put the building gen plugin link. You can just just click the link, and it will lead you to the official site to get the building gems. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my videos, tutorials, and sharings. If you feel all these tutorials and sharings are very helpful to your 3D modeling, 3D animations, and 3D game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new videos, tutorials, or sharings, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy! Happy 3D modeling, 3D animations, and 3D game developing. See you!